All right, guys, just got the uh, hike and bike sleeping bag in the mail. Same with the uh, fly top <clears throat> two person tent. Um, this is goose down in it, so it's a uh, zero degrees, zero degree bag. Um, can go that low. And right here, the fly top, it's a two person tent, all seasons, um, all four season tent. Very great way. Very good uh, equipment here because that means you got shelter and you got warmth. Um, other than that, I do have a Teton Sports Outfitter 4600. Um, sleeping bag fits in that bottom pocket just fine. And then I use these uh, compression straps for the tent and they fit on the bottom pretty well. Good investment. I'm going to do some uh, camping and nature videos soon. Um, once this coronavirus lets up, then I'm going to actually start traveling. So, But yeah, guys, um, you never know what their future holds. So always be prepared um, to bug out to uh, start new again if uh, society collapses. And... Um, Really, I just need to keep myself safe from the elements and such. So, uh, all right, guys, that's just a little rundown of what I got. Um, but other than that, I do have a video, and it's all on my rucksack right here, and uh, lists everything that I got in that. Basically, I'm going to transfer to this if I travel or go homeless. Um, so either way, yeah, it's a good thing to have. Um, very good equipment. I think anybody can go far with a tent and a sleeping bag and a bag. Uh, clothes and um, fishing gear. What else? Uh, hunting supplies, stuff like that. Like machetes, axes, all that good stuff. So... Um, but yeah, if I have to spend a couple nights out, then I'll do it, and I'm prepared. Um, doesn't get that cold here in Virginia. It's not, like, unbearable, but, um, I mean, I used to live on the border of Canada in Buffalo, New York, and uh, it gets pretty frigid up there, I'll tell you some. Um, and the snow goes high above you um, every year, almost, so... Alright guys, I'll, I'll catch you all later. See you on the other side. Peace.